been extremely fortunate that God smiled on you and allowed you to sit around most of the time doing jack shit and you have yet to be punished for that. I've spoken to dudes and like, yeah, you know, I had a bad couple months. Why? My girl left me. You've wasted months over some Think of how much God loves you to have given you the grace, given you the opportunity to waste months of human time over some chick. Like, talk about blessed head to toe. If I waste months, empires are gonna collapse. If for 10 years, if you didn't avoid doing what you knew you needed to do, what would you be like? Because you're not everything you could be and you know it. What would happen if you just stopped wasting the opportunities that are in front of you? You'd be who knows how much more efficient? 10 times more efficient, 20 times more efficient. You have no idea how efficient, efficient people get. It's off the charts. Do you have the guts to fail? If you don't fail, you're not even trying. To get something you never had, you have to do something you never did. Imagine you're on your deathbed and standing around your deathbed are the ghosts representing your unfulfilled potential. The ghost of the ideas you never acted on. The ghost of the talents you didn't use. And they're standing around your bed angry, disappointed, and upset. They say, we came to you because you could have brought us to life, they say. And now we have to go to the grave together. So I ask you today, how many ghosts are going to be around your bed when your time comes? You have the power to do more than you can ever begin to imagine. Don't underestimate yourself. You don't know enough about yourself to become a cynic. And so you've got to challenge yourself to access that power that you have within you. You're more than a conqueror. At the end of every day, you look yourself in the mirror and you ask yourself, did I get better today? If the answer is yes, and you do that for five years, 10 years, 15 years, how much better are you gonna be? Are you getting better every single day? That's the question. And it's just taking small steps. You don't try to get it all done in one day, in one week, in one year. It's the process of getting better every day and doing that for a period of years that then create the masterpiece. Well, I can tell bad times are right around the corner again. I can tell by all the emails I'm getting talking about. I can't get a break in life. I hate that damn mentality, but I can't get a break. You aren't given any breaks in life. You make them for yourself. We are all being tested in life. While my test is different than yours, you will be tested. And how you face that test and how you overcome that test determines the rest of your life. The one mentality that you must have in life is that regardless of what's in front of you, you still must grind. I'll never be in the Olympics. I'll never be a professional athlete, but still I grind. I feel that most things I do, but still I grind. I don't want to do half the shit I do, but still I grind. And that one day, you see me down a dark alley, run at one o'clock in the morning, no one thing. I was grinding. Stay home.